we need help. We really need help here. I mean, we are not getting the help that we need. Employees from Laconia's CAP agency and Lakes Region Mental Health helped people clearing out the homeless encampment get rid of trash on Monday before police go through with another sweep next week. We're just waiting to hear what we can do. You know, hopefully the next place will have a dumpster and porta potties and stuff that is available um, because the housing is um, ridiculous right now. <laughs> the encampment, while tucked away in the woods, is on city-owned property right next to a residential neighborhood, and people living nearby have raised safety concerns in recent weeks. There's um, de definitely a lack of resources, but not due to lack of trying. For a lot of the shelters are already full, so now the city is working to come up with a longer-term plan to help people find a more permanent place to live. We are looking very closely at a housing first model right now. We'd like to start a pilot program in the city, um, so people, when they uh, have have stable housing uh, can better address issues of employment, uh, substance use disorder, or any mental health issues they're, they're experiencing. And there's uh, a great deal of will um, both in the community and within the service providers and in the persons experiencing homelessness as a community to all participate at the same table and that's that's how we'll resolve it. And again, a lot of people have already been moving out on their own, but police are going into the encampment next week to reinforce that. We're live in Laconia, Hannah Cotter, WMUR News 9.